Hi, pretty people, it's your boy Nathan Shah, and today we're getting controversial. We love ourselves some good controversy on this channel, don't we? So, we're talking about the concept of trender core. Trender core, what is it? So, if you're not trans on the internet, you might not be familiar with the concept of truscums and trans meds. It's basically a shit ton of bullies. A lot of them are young teenagers, and like, you know, it's a tough time for everybody. You're having a shitty time with being trans, and so you're like, bashing up the wrong people. Those people kind of believe that there are specific rules for being trans, you gotta have dysphoria, you gotta hate yourself till, you know, infinity, and it's kind of really harmful. Um, so they have taken to, well, not just like bullying random trans people online and ignoring the fact that, you know, like Western civilization and colonialism have really brought upon these like weird fucking categories that are, you know, restrictive to gender roles that have been here by indigenous civilizations and non-white cultures for very fucking long times, you know? Those people are just, like, ignoring all of that, and they're going out there with all of their hatred, and they're like, bitch. So basically, one of the things they like doing is making caricatures of real trans people and fake trans people, or as they like to call them, transgenders. But what exactly is a transgender? Um, according to them, you gotta have colorful hair, take that on a list, a lot of piercings and tattoos, I suppose. Your boy's here for it. You gotta show off your titties. I apologize for saying that word, please don't drag me, but that's what they do, right? They're like, they don't want to call a chest. If you don't wear a binder or can't bind for medical reasons, personal preference, psychological reasons or whatever, according to them, you're not really trans because why would you do that? So, um, hashtag rude. So basically that is, um, I think what they, you know, th 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 for some reason that to them means you're not really trans. I think it's also like wearing skirts, uh, like dresses, and basically I think it is aimed a lot on like people who were assigned female at birth. Um, and I mean, you can see a lot of insecurity of especially trans masculine people there who are like, oh my gosh, if I don't cut ties with everything that's deemed feminine, I'm not really a man. And it's like, very harmful and disgusting. But what Trender Core does, and that's why we love it here, is subvert all of these ideas and make them into a style choice. And I mean, I am very, very much up on fashion, so... I fucking love this idea. So basically, it's like doing all of these things because you love to express yourself and just like do your thing and just roll with it and, you know, get all those angry transphobes out of their holes and just make them really angrier because <laughs> you're not really taking all of their bullying seriously i mean those people will grow out of it and realize that you know the world isn't black and white we all grow into our understanding of shit so yes i think trying core is a really cool fun concept um if you know who originally coined it i've seen it on various instagram pages let me know in the comments below um, if you have something to say about it, something nice and productive and non-harassing. Please leave it down in the comments below. Also leave a like if you like this video. Subscribe, smash that bell button, honey. And um, yeah, I'll see you next time.